You got ID? Hey, uh, Leo, I think we got a buyer for Diaz's merchandise. Gotta give him a ring, man. Set up the deal, you know? Where are you now? You okay, Leo? You sound kinda different. Just tell me where you are. Who the hell is this? Put Leo on, man. Leo's gone away for a while. He left me in charge. Screw you, man. For God's sake, it's you. Oh, jeez. I'm gonna need new pants. Hey, those psychos from up north, they've been on the horn, and they're coming down here soon. Now, where is the goddamn money? Relax, relax. We're not at that point oh, yet. Oh, I thought that you were taking care of this. I really did. And now those guidos say we gotta do them a favor. You mean I gotta do them a favor? Oh, of course that's what I mean. Do I look like I can intimidate a jury? I couldn't intimidate a child, and believe me, I've tried. Now look, it's either that or Ferelli's cousin Giorgio gets five years for fraud. You gotta take these guys out. I understand. Help the jury change their minds. Don't worry about oh, it. Oh, no, 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 no! I tried that. The jury case didn't go so well. So make them change their minds. All right, more crap to wipe up. What did I do wrong in a past life? Dumb Florida moron. Are you late for tea off too? Get lost! Question, but my solution is easy. I'm gonna talk for a long time about a subject not in any way related, and pretty soon people will forget all about it. I'll remind people that I have a great haircut, and that under my stewardship, my city has had on average 15% better weather than before. Well, Crime rates only go up if you don't turn the graph upside down. Turn it upside down, and they have have, have, under me, Alex Shrub. Vote Shrub for president, and you'll have a friendly face in the White House. A man you can trust. A local man who likes golf and laughing and photo opportunities at your store or place of business. Just send me a letter. I'll send you an automated photocopied response. We call it democracy, and that's where the money goes. Now, just a Yo, minute. Don't interrupt. Let me finish. Remember Giorgio? Remember he's innocent? Ah! The whole state will be flooded and ruined, and then they'll have to leave. We must build a moat to the north or they will come down and ruin this great state. And Mr. Hickory, were you born in Florida? <laughs> What a stupid question of all the cheek, were you? Of course not. No one's been born in Florida since 1877, but I've been here for five years. Which is a very long time. Yes, it is. A very long time. Almost as long as this show. Ladies and gentlemen, you're listening to Pressing Issues with me, Maurice Chavez. Presiding over some of the least informed debate on the radio. In this episode of Pressing the Issue, 
we had Alex Rubb, Callum Grayshaw, and John Florida Hickory discussing safety. I guess you've all got to make up your own minds. Should we be as wet as fish or a corrupt money-grabbing thief? Gentlemen, I feel we really got somewhere, and that Vice City and people everywhere know a lot more than they did before we began. And now, over to Jonathan and Melissa to talk to you about public radio in your area. You're listening to VCPR, the radio station for disoriented and unrealistic college professors who wear fuzzy sweaters and find everything terribly interesting. I'm Michelle Montanius. And I'm Jonathan Freeloader. Public radio is very important. You may have heard my recent hour-long story about my hike in the park. That was fascinating and very important for everyone, even the... Guilty is a dirty word. Ah, ah, ah! 